Hey, what's up guys? I just built some shelves for my warehouse, so I figured I'd share the process of how I did it. All in, it took me about an hour, and it was a little over 100 bucks. This is a much more solid and cost-effective solution versus like any of those prefabricated ones you'd get online or at your local big box store. The only tools you'll need are a saw and a drill driver. You're also going to need some 3 inch screws, some 1 inch screws, wood glue, and a tape measure. A speed square isn't totally necessary, but I recommend it to, you know, well, keep things square. I'll include a detailed list of all the other materials in the description. Also, it's important to remember that this is not fine furniture. I'm putting this in my garage and warehouse, not trying to land it on the moon. Start by taking the 8 foot 2x4s and marking them with a cutoff at 6 feet. From there, start at the bottom and measure every 16 inches, leaving the last one at 2 feet. Then, use some scrap piece of 2x3 as a spacer. Draw your final markings. Two and a half inches below the initial mark you made to account for the width of the shelf platforms. Next, take the two foot pieces you cut off earlier and divide them into four six inch blocks. And then take these blocks and glue them directly under those final marks you just made. When you place the blocks, slide it into place to help the glue get spread around and you should feel like some suction uh, when you try to pull the block off and if you don't feel that then you should definitely put some more glue on. But finish off by gluing a piece of scrap 2x3 flush with the bottom edge of the uprights so you can attach wheels later on. Moving on to the shelf platforms, start by measuring 21 inch segments on your 2x3. These will be the spreaders that go on the support frame. Attach the spreaders to the 2x3s with glue and 3 inch screws every 32 inches. For the plywood, just have them cut it in half at the store and save yourself the trouble because it's a lot easier than trying to cut thin quarter inch plywood yourself. Slide it in position and secure it in place with 1 inch screws, making sure not to overdrive them, otherwise you'll blow right through the plywood. Final assembly, you'll need to prop up the first shelf platform so you can get it attached to your uprights. I use jack stands, but you can use a cardboard box or even a step stool. Secure it to the vertical supports using the three inch screws. Take the jack stands out and attach the platform to the other two supports. Slide in and screw in the rest of those shelf platforms. And once you get them all screwed in, tip the whole thing over on its side so you can screw in the wheels. If you use locking casters on one side and then fixed wheels on the other, you get a lot more stability and control both when you're moving the shelves around and when you don't want them to move. But that's it for this one y'all. If you liked the video, go ahead and click thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this. I will see you in the next one.